Hi right, to all our Cool Automation Nation members out there today. The new video that I'm going to talk about is how we can activate Line 3 on our Coolmaster Net. So Line 3 has been specifically designed if we have cool plugs connecting to our Coolmaster Net. So as we know, we've got up to eight lines on this device for eight, you know, for multiple brands of AC units to be able to connect to VRF systems. But we may have a scenario out there where we've got a VRF system, but we've also got some standalone ducted or split systems. So we can connect those standalone ducted or split systems through this one Coolmaster Net. So in the case of this device, it's been set to Dakin on line one. So line one will feed the VRF systems, but we can also activate line three if we've got some standalones and we'll connect them with some of our cool plug devices. So I'm gonna show you guys how to activate line three, which is this line that we see here, line three. Um, and it's very easy to do. So in the settings, we just go ahead and press press that button with my fat finger and it brings up the main menu we go to HVAC lines and we want to activate line 3 so line 3 there we press line 3 and then we go to HVAC type which at the moment is unused and we press it and we scroll down and we want to find CH. There we have CH. And we press the on CH and it's now telling us the reset required. So we will go ahead there, unhook the power, unhook it back on and we should hopefully find line three or activated for us and there you go so if you look at that top left hand corner there you'll see line one dk and line two is nothing on it and ch on line three so that's now telling us that that line three is now activated and we can daisy chain our cool plugs off that line three hope the video helps guys um yeah I'll talk to you soon